Newshound Guru Militia Man, we are witnessing something unprecedented at this level. There is definitely something significant happening in Iraq, and the timing seems crucial. Intel Guru Frank26, Iraq reports boots on the ground firefly, Sadr has been communicating with us, informing us that although we were scheduled to demonstrate due to unmet promises, he announced on television this morning that the Million Man March has been cancelled. Frank, why are we not proceeding is it because they will deliver what they promised in my opinion, Sadr asked Sudani not to organize the march, hence the cancellation. Intel Guru Mark Z, from PDK with a not a crisis at all rate drop of 50 basis points the article Fed and Powell unleash chaos across markets caught my attention. They claim to have strategies to safeguard their exchange rate and ample foreign reserves. Why is this significant it indicates that Iraq is ready. Newshound Guru Sampson, article, Al Sudani leaves early next week to participate in the UN General Assembly meetings in New York. Newshound Guru Sandy Ingram, if the Iraqi dinar IQD were to revalue to 0.25 per dinar, a holding of 1 million IQD would yield a profit of 250,000. With a tax rate of 35% for a single filer with no dependents, the tax liability on this amount would be 83,188, leaving you with 166,812. If the IQD revalues to between 0.80 and 1, the profit would be 800,000, minus exchange costs. At a 37% tax rate, the tax payable would be 284,901, resulting in a net amount of 515,000. State taxes are not included in these calculations. This is a serious matter, and fairness is not guaranteed. A new president would not be able to change this situation immediately, as tax legislation requires congressional approval. Dinar Guru Note, consult with tax experts to develop a plan tailored to your situation. Newshound Guru Pimpi, I share your goal. The zeros are still on the dinar, but if the exchange rate were magically adjusted to 3.22, it would be an incredible surprise to wake up to. That would be fantastic. Intel Guru Mark Z, by PDK right now. I derate my warm and fuzzy feeling at about 9.9. .9. It's quite cozy and fluffy. This week brought excellent news from Iraq, budget tables have been approved, and the HCL is expected soon. Redemption Center and banking staff, particularly those in wealth management for major institutions, are on a shortened on-call status this weekend, just in case. Comment, I still hear RV in September. Mark Z, I continue to hear that as well. Hopefully, it's accurate. Newshound Guru Claire, article, Al Sudani leaves early next week to participate in the UN General Assembly meetings in New York. Intel Guru Wolverine, via Judy Byington staff at Redemption Centers have received training, and the QFS is fully integrated. Behind the scenes, things are rapidly progressing. This will be our celebration week. Newshound Guru Militia Man, article quote, Alak points out that the declining price of oil has no impact on the rise in the exchange rate because Iraq has foreign currency reserves to defend it. Central banks are doing exactly what they should advocating for the exchange rate. Whether it's at 1,310, as it currently is, or whatever the real effective exchange rate will be in the future they have a solution. This ISNT knew, they're doing what they know best. The initiative to drop the three zeros is still in progress. Intel Guru Frank26, report on boots on the ground activity from Iraq Firefly, on the 25th, Sadr will be walking the streets, and we will join in millions. Starting on the 25th, we will do this weekly until we get paid. Sadr has organized this, and we will support him for our constitutional rights. Frank, Sadr leads well and won T act violently. Remember, 
protesting could slow down the financial process, so avoid it. Firefly, we will help hasten the arrival of a new rate that is definitely expected. Note, watch this space for a later update on Firefly's protest. Newshound Intel Guru MNT Goat, many already recognize that Iraq is incredibly rich, and it truly is. The Kuwaiti dinar is currently one of the most valuable currencies in the world. If you compare Iraq's potential to generate wealth with other countries, it far surpasses Kuwait. So why is the IQD valued at roughly 0.006 while the KWD is over 3 Intel Guru Mark Z, PDK what have we seen this week there has been progress with the HCL. Payrolls are suddenly being decided upon, which couldn't happen without knowing the new rates. They ve resolved the money laundering issue with Iran. Considering Sudani's recent statement about raising the dinar's value during his tenure, this should happen in the next few months. So, hold tight and keep the faith.